Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Gran Turismo 6. Today is episode number 38. If you guys do want to keep up to date with what is going on on the Mechanic CG channel, then make sure to go down in the description and check out all of our social links. We've got Discord, Twitter, and Instagram. Uh, and if you want to help support the channel, then make sure to hit that join button, that subscribe button, all that like button. And hopefully you guys do enjoy today's video. Right, so today what we're going to be doing is we're going to be taking this Renault Sport Megane Trophy on the World Touring Car 550 Performance Point Championship. Uh, this is going to be really fun because I've been looking forward to drive some touring cars. Um, so the maximum performance rating we can take is about 600. So what I want to do is just put in a couple of performance upgrades. Uh, we can't put in turbo kits at all. Um, let's go chuck you in, chuck you in, and chuck you in, because you're the cheapest. I can put this in as well. There we go. Um, should we put a racing exhaust? Nah, we'll leave it for now. Um, we definitely need to go to body, I think. Um, oh, we can't do anything there. Let's put some... Have we got racing hards? Yes, we do. That's decent. Um, as well, this is a base coat model, so I'm thinking we can paint the body, hopefully. Can we not paint this any colour? Oh, you have to click it to actually change it. Never mind, ignore me. Oh, I do like the green. The green on a Clio. Oh, but then the light blue looks good as well. French racing blue. Uh, I feel like um, metallic colours won't look good on this car. Oh, it's such a tough choice, actually. We'll go green. We'll go green. It's always a tough choice to pick a colour that you're going to use. Yeah, I think I'm. I think I'm good with that colour. Green looks really good. I think the blue might have been a little bit too dark, so you wouldn't be able to see the car too much. But yeah, that looks very nice. Work completed. Right. It's a lot cooler today as well, so there shouldn't be the noise of the fans in the background. Um, nope, we're not going on the shifter championship. It is the 500 PP. Uh, we are doing a championship. 36,000 per race. We're looking at Scirocco's, ISF's, and AMG Mercedes, which is interesting. But we are in the McGann for this one. Here we go. World Touring Car Championship race number one around the Grand Valley Speedway. This is going to be fun. Uh, so we've got M3s, E92s, GTRs, quite a few GTRs, and a Diablo GT2. Interesting. Right, let's go. Oh my gosh, the engine can sound worse if it tried. Very nice. Look at the car. That is a nice car. I definitely think there's a problem with the engine noise in this game. Because the car has no engine. It genuinely has no engine. It's just turbo whistle at the moment. Thanks, Polyphony. Very broken. That is the Diablo, I think. It's struggling to go in a straight line right now. Perfect. Awesome. Very close to the opal there. Right, squeezing past through here. Coming up behind the GTR now.
I've wanted to drive this Clio for a while. I saw it in the Renault Sports Shop and I was like, I want to drive that at some point. And we're finally driving it. There's the ISF there. Come on, come on. This is going to be a good race. Oh no, we've hit the GTR. I'm sorry. Awesome. Perfect. Through the tunnel again. They are. There they are. Come on, come on, go, go. Uh, that looks like a BMW up in front. Still looks like a BMW, but I can't actually tell because I can't see the badge. Well, it's definitely got M Sport colours on it, so if it's not, yeah, there you go, BMW. Both of the BMWs are always at the front of the pack. So it's nice to see a Renault Sport taking the lead. Perfect. Very nice. It's really good being able to get into like the super fast car territory now. Perfect. Look at that. Nice. Perfect breaking opportunity there. There are 16 cars currently racing around this track right now. I can just imagine what the experience would be like actually driving this track. Or driving any of the uh, Gran Turismo originals. If they were real tracks, they would just be amazing. Perfect. 
Perfect. Very good. Coming up to the S-Bends now. And then after this lap will be the final lap. Come on, come on. We've got Mount Panorama left to do as well. Mount Panorama is one of the tracks. That's going to be a long race. Just right. There we go. The BMWs have been on our tail for quite a while now. But we have managed to stay in the lead. Very nice. Risky there. Perfect. All right, going back through the mountain through a tunnel. There are so many tunnels in this uh, track. It's going to be fun, though, to see cars going through these tunnels on GT7. With ray tracing and all that stuff, oh, it's going to look amazing. Beamers, get back. Without the engine upgrades, I think these races would actually have been impossible. And there we go, across the line. 1 minute 54.57 for that last lap. 9 minutes 34.3 overall. Very good. And look at that green Clio go. Right, let's take out 36,000 credits, three stars, and move on to the next race, which is race number two. And for this one, we're going to be going around Tokyo R246. Nice. I like this track. Right, let's do this. We are on Tokyo Route 246. Such an amazing track this is. Actually, one of my favourite tracks from uh, Gran Turismo PSP. It's an original track as well. Original city track. There we go. Nice. Perfect. Get past the Bosch car. Perfect. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Nice. There's the uh, Lamborghini Diablo up ahead. It's a very weird, wonky looking car. No! 
How did we roll it? How did that happen? We definitely need to watch out for that curve next time. Perfect. And brakes. Hit the wall there. That wasn't great. We've now got quite a lot of time to catch up because of that flip. We didn't even overtake the Diablo. We're too busy judging the Diablo. I think... I think that was karma for me dissing the Diablo. Well, unfortunately, I still overtook the Diablo. Perfect. It was that curb there that we flipped up on. Right, we got a load of cars up ahead. Go, go, go. Sixteen seconds behind. Why do I get the feeling we're not gonna win this race? To be fair, we could get third. In fact, even second is a possibility right now. The first might be a push. It means we won't be able to crash on that curb again, otherwise that's it, our run's over. Perfect overtake there. Relying on the late braking to get through. Ten seconds behind. We need to regain five seconds per lap. Come on, let's do this. That definitely doesn't help crashing like that.
awesome. Come on, come on, we can do this. Ah, oh, we're always crashing on that corner. That is such a dodgy corner. Nice. Gaining on him. His first place. We have this one lap to try and overtake him. Awesome. Right, squeeze through. Perfect. Nice. Right, slow down. Perfect. No! That is unbelievable. Right at the finish, we did exactly the same as what we did on the first lap. Let's try and regain one of those positions at least. I can take a second, but I'm not taking a last. Oh my days, how did we do that twice? Ah, oh, that car! That curb! Twice we rolled it! Twice! Unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. Right, so we are here at Mount Panorama. And me being the dumbass that I am, I uh, managed to cancel the race because I crashed at the first corner. Oh. Don't do the same thing again. Uh, and decided to uh, reset the championship. Um... So this isn't a championship race. We ended up coming third in the championship because I quit. Um, and I'm not doing it again. Not till tomorrow. So, fun times. But hopefully this race goes all right. I really don't want to do like 15 million races. There we go, nice. Awesome. Alright, so down for here, get into third gear. Try not to cut too many of the corners. Perfect. Awesome. Right, we need to watch out for this corner because this one's always a trap for us. Whoa, 
you weren't going fast enough. You can easily go around that corner like 20 miles an hour more than you were. Awesome. Perfect. Right, we have five more cars to overtake. Four more laps to do it in. Awesome. Perfect. Oh, nearly went into the wall there. Right, nice. Come on, let's get past. Would be nice sometime today. Perfect. We probably could have extended the gearbox a little bit. Nice. Look at how many rear cannons are on that Audi. Squeezing through here. Very nice. Awesome. Okay. Perfect. All right, so down here. And next corner is the risky corner that everyone always seems to overshoot. how high up we are. The rest of the track is miles down. Perfect. They are quite far behind now, which gives us a little bit of breathing room. Nice. Right, we've got two more laps to do. Awesome. Nice. Very good there. T 
two Germans are very close behind, but we are well ahead. taken by the beamer there. I think what happened was we uh, hit one of the curbs and the car just like lost all grip from that, that point onwards. What was that? Literally crashed into my car. Right, nice. Perfect. Very good breaking point there. Right, on to the final lap now. Right, we're aiming to beat 2 minutes 8.8. .8. Let's see if we can do it. Hit the wall there, not great. Let's go, 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 go. And off on, yeah, that's what I mean by it's easy to overshoot that corner. It is such a fast corner and you take it at such high speed. Right, nice. Onto the main straight or the longest straight for the final time. Nice. Perfect. And there we go, we did beat it. Awesome. Just managed to beat the time there. 11 minutes, nearly 11 minutes flat for that race. Nice. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe. If you want to keep up to date on the Mechanic CG channel, then be sure to check out the description for our social links. We've got Twitter, Discord and Instagram if you want to go check all of those out. Uh, if you want to help support the channel, make sure to hit that join button. Or you can go and grab yourself some merch. Either would mean the world to me. But thank you guys so much for watching. Peace. Oh.